my drink, y'all. I'm back. I had to change my battery. I'm about to put this one on the charger. So one of my friends just told me it's supposed to be raining tonight and I hope it don't rain while we out because I'm gonna be upset if it start pouring rain when we outside. I'm trying to take a nap before we go out tonight and my daughter want me to come get her from work and I'll be, I've been driving around all day. I'm, I wanna lay down. That's the only thing I hate about living out of state. Like you can't just walk, right? In New York, we will walk a few blocks to get to and from our location. And if you worked near your job, that was even better. But if it was cold, I wouldn't walk. But on a nice day, we will walk a few blocks. Out here, there ain't no such thing as walking a few blocks. I put my GPS on for my address where I'm going driving. And it'd be like a 10, 15 minute drive walking and say, um, 30 minutes. I'm like, what? 30 minutes? So, get somewhere walking is crazy to me. I'm frying these chicken um, thighs. We're going to make Chick fil A style sandwiches. I got my pickles and my Chick fil A sauce. And I got my bread. So, this is what the kids want to eat. I don't know if my friend going to eat one, but it's what we doing right now. I'm about to. I got my wine for tonight, so maybe drink it red wine. I'll put this battery on the charger. There's really no shopping stores out here in Florida. Like you really gotta order offline. Like coming from New York where we could go to a certain area and have multiple choices of stores to look for clothing at. It's like not like that out here at all. If you're trying to find a last minute outfit, good luck. I'll pick y'all back up later when me and my friend getting ready to go out. We'll probably have a little girl chat while I'm um, recording us getting ready. Go ahead, keep pouring. All right, that should be good. Making milkshakes. I'm done cooking the chicken. Then you can make a sandwich. Put the bread on the plate. All right. Which piece you want? You want to put a pickle on top of it? Homemade style Chick-fil-A sandwiches with Chick-fil-A sauce. We did that, right, y'all? We got everything. We don't got waffle fries. We made regular fries and we got the milkshake. Chick-fil-A at home. I'm about to do my makeup, y'all. Oh, I dropped it. All right, I did my makeup. I just got to put on my shoes. Took my bonnet off. My friend is dressed, looking up I good. Okay, ready for the night. We just got to put on our shoes and that's it. I'm not taking my camera out with me. I'm gonna just vlog. Well, I'm gonna just take some pictures and videos on my phone and then I'll use that to upload to this vlog. Well, we about to be outside, y'all. We about to have fun. I've never been to this place before, so I hope it's good. I hope I like it. I hope we have fun and enjoy our night. I'll check back in with y'all later, which will be Sunday because I know I'm gonna come home. I'm be drunk. I'm gonna go to bed. <laughs> I pick that back up on Sunday. Yeah, keep that shit there. Yeah. Ooh, ooh, 
Y'all see that? Ooh. <laughs> If I had a dick, I'd pull, pull it out and piss on it. We getting ready. This is the fit, y'all. Just I gotta tie my strings and everything, but I gotta do my makeup. It's the outfit for the night. I'm gonna show y'all when I put my shoes on. And we on time because I said we leaving like at 10, 15, 10, 20. So let me go do my makeup. Let me turn this light off. We were supposed to bend me. We I got tickets. I think the tickets say free before eleven, but it's after eleven, so we just gonna have to end up paying. She in there chatting, eating pizza. I'm still sipping. I'm gonna see the bathroom. We were taking so many flicks. Y'all know I gotta make a good thumbnail. So, but we about to leave now. Let me sip my wine. Because I don't know how they drinks is in there. Nine times out of ten when I go out, the drinks don't be that good. It don't be strong. I'd rather drink at home with pregame. Unless you want to make me some towels. All right, I'm out, y'all. I'll catch up with y'all later. Y'all, I'm just picking up my camera. We had fun last night. Oh my God. I wish I could have recorded. I'm leaving. Bye. Bye. We about to go out for brunch. Took us forever to get ready. Nation sleeps? All right, I'm leaving. I'll be back later. Where's those? To brunch. What? You know what brunch is? Yeah. Oh. It's only adults, Denny. It's no kids there. Thank you. Love you. Don't forget to do your laundry. I did my makeup. I guess we'll take pictures when we get to the place because we took so many pictures in the house yesterday. No, for real. We cannot have the same background. Right. <laughs> like, we don't really go <laughs> nowhere. <laughs> Mm. I'll be coughing and getting choked out of nowhere. Yeah. My friend look cute. Let me show you how I fit. Thank you, baby. Okay. Shave me. <laughs> it's the ass for me. It's always the ass for me. <laughs> hey, make it do what it do. Hey, twerk. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Yeah. I'm really a hype man. <laughs> Noodle, wash that blender. I'm doing to make milkshakes and don't never want to clean up. Mm. I wish I had some milkshake. Well, I do, but it's only rag. Let be out here. I, we bought a bottle of wine last night. I can't find it. I need to bring a cup so I can drink. Oh yeah, we should have that. Oh yeah, but we gotta find a wine too. Oh yeah, but bring a cup anyway. You want a cup? Yeah. I know that wine is somewhere under the car seat. I was trying to find it last night, but I was I was drunk, couldn't find it. I don't know where all my cups be going. Wash these dishes, Noodle. I just never want to clean up. Why I brought the hookah piece home? That yellow piece is from the lounge, the hookah spot we went to yesterday. We was going to a club. DJ Emmy was supposed to be in there. Well, I guess he came, but I had got free tickets. And by the time we left, it was late. So I don't think the line was so long to get in there. I've never been there before. But the line was very long. And we ended up, my friend seeing some girls coming out. And she was like, why y'all coming out? What happened? And they was like, it was $40 to get in. They didn't want to get in that bag for $40. I'm like, so we got off the line. And plus the line was long, like I said. So we ended up going to a place, a hookah spot. 
that I've been to before. It's one of the only places I know that stay open till 4 o'clock over here. I don't know what time we left. We probably got there after 1. We was online for like 30 minutes trying to get into the hookah spot. I got my cups. <laughs> Hopefully we find a bottle of wine in the car. This is my first time going to brunch out here. Never been to brunch out here before. I got on boots. I never really had my feet closed in. I always got on slippers. My foot got a cramp in it. Uh. I'ma see if I record while I'm in there. Maybe I might take my camera in. I don't know, it's early so I should be able to. They got mimosas, so hopefully it's unlimited mimosas. I don't gotta drive. Let me find my bottle of wine. I'll pick y'all back up. I'm about to drop these cups. Just about to drop There go the bottle of wine, y'all. Like <laughs> and there go my heels. I Yo, really be leaving well, my shit in the car. I can't get it out like this. I gotta put it to the front. Let me get this bottle. Ain't trying to break my nails. We bought this on the way to the lounge just saying that we barely drunk anything. Went to the liquor store. Cause there's one liquor store I'll be going to that's there until two in the morning. I think we went to another liquor store though. I don't remember coming home, no nothing. I think it's bad that when you, when you drink, you don't remember the night before. I don't know. That happened to y'all. Is it normal? <laughs> uh, my friend is a smoker, not really a drinker, so yeah. she can't relate to the drinking. I just feel like alcoholics is too rowdy. Y'all get drunk and y'all start bugging out. See, people who smoke, I have they fun. Call, they I drink and have you know fun. Alcoholics always want to fight. And Not smoke. me. People who smoke, they just be chilling. Sometimes, no, that happened to me one time. I had a fight. I was on Dre. We went to a barbecue by Dre Building, and I had tried to swing on this girl. I fell. <laughs> Yeah, what? yeah, I tried to swing on a girl. That shit was mad bad. I said, every time I heard it, I'm like, nah. How I try to swing on somebody that I fall? <laughs> and I had mad. I was make. We had some drinks, and it's crazy because before we went outside, we was like, oh yeah, these drinks will get you like done. I didn't think I was gonna have a fight that night. I never really drink to fight. I always drink to have a good time. I mean, I can still have a good time without drinks, but every time I'm drinking, I have fun. I never had a drinks and had a bad time. <laughs> we made it to the brunch spot and we just watching everybody and we talking mad shit out of our car we like these bitches look a mess look at this why would you wear sweatpants to a brunch spot i don't want them to see my camera but yeah we just watching everybody they look crazy like i am seeing some guy pee in the corner some guy try to fit his car oh my god her wig is crazy her outfit is crazy she look crazy she tried. She she, she tried. <laughs> she tried it. <laughs> Baby girl, she trying to get her bed tonight. That's what I'm talking about. And we just in here sipping the wine and drinking. We drinking our wine. We talking shit about everything we see. We need to go inside. This shit closed at nine. We we trying to go to the crab spot. They close at ten. So we probably leave from here like at I don't know. Depending on the vibe in here. Yo, I don't ever know what time I'm leaving the spot. I think a way to get this money by tomorrow. I think a way to get this money by tomorrow. I gotta think a way to get huh? I think a way to get this money by tomorrow. I ain't drinking no more after this. I ain't drinking no more wine. I'm gonna see what they mimosas taste like. I think a way to get this money by tomorrow. Somebody in this car next to me, they've been in there for a little minute. I don't wanna turn all the way. I can see it. Yeah, I see the car. They been in that shit. They got their windows tinted, so I know they looking at me and I can't see them. I need to get my windows tinted. When my brother come back, I'm gonna have him do that for me. He do everything on my car. 
That's a very big ass cave. Oh, that's an arcade. So you love this bitch. Who's that? Shantia. Who's that? You don't know who that is? Mm-mm. I'm about to tell you who that is. She is fire. I'm not gonna take my cat right now. I'm gonna be lit. I'm gonna just probably take a little video, a couple of videos on my phone and some pictures and that's it. I'll check back in with y'all later. We left the brunch spot. Like, they service in there. It was a lot of people in there. So we right here at the crab seafood spot. Crafty crab. Can I get y'all started today? Oh, I can look at the drink menu, but I'm ready for a drink. Let me get some water right now. Okay, can we get water with lemon? But let me look at the drink. Okay. All right. <laughs> <laughs> My friend hungry. I ain't, I ain't ready to eat. I just want to like some shrimp, like like jumbo shrimp. Yeah, they're cool. I mean, they're decent sized shrimp. They're not like puny. All right, can we have an order shrimp? All right, I do want the headless shrimp. Headless. All right, half pound or a pound. Uh, Craft occasion, butter, garlic, lemon pepper, the boom, which is all three mixed together. The boom. I don't even know what I want. I like the boom. The boom is good. Like, it's like a combination of everything. And, and do you want that mild, medium, or fire? Anything else? I can get broccoli with that. Yeah. We got like egg, sausage. Let me just get the shrimp right now. Alright. I'm not even gonna eat them in the crab legs. That shit's gonna be too messy. But they give you the things so you can wear. This covers, this cover your whole thing. You ain't gonna get nothing on you. <laughs> you wore white to a seafood foil restaurant? No, we came from uh, 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 brunch. Yeah, we went to have brunch. Oh, okay. But we eat the food there. It was packed. Oh, okay. So. You want to eat my fries? I don't want the fries, but it comes with. I want the um the catfish. Okay. But I got French fries, onion rings, sweet potato fries, uh, coleslaw, potatoes, corn. Let me coleslaw. Okay. Anything else? I'm gonna drink. What's a good strong drink? Uh, the purple Long Island's pretty good. It's sweet, but it it mixed. I don't like I don't like Long Island. Uh, the blue Hawaiian is really good too. All right, I'll, I'll try that. One. The blue Hawaiian, yeah. All right. Hers will take longer than yours because hers is fried. Yeah, white. No, I think that oh, that's the chalaba. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, I'll just take that for now. I'm going to go to the All right. Oh, I'm sorry. One more thing. This is kind of sad. I don't know. Um, I'm going to eat some of my fresh food. I don't think you have any food. I don't have like eat my food. Tomatoes. Like, I order, my, my order comes with four pieces of fish. I know I'm not going to eat all this with fish. Chicken tenders. All right. I got Yeah, it's like the uh, chicken tenders chopped up on top of it. Yeah. Yeah. No. Like, yeah, like the fried chicken tenders. Yeah. For the house salad? Yeah. For the house salad? Yeah, there's no way they could, um, do that. No, no. The house salad come with chicken on it? No, the chicken one. Oh. 
I thought you asked for house salad. You asked for chicken salad. No, I was seeing like what they had. Oh. The chicken salad is the same way for us. Let me get the house salad. Let me get the house salad. I should be good with that. I should be good with that. Help me up, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I never had their chicken. I only had their shrimp. I had the, the, the sauce you got, and I had their crab shrimp, and it came with potato and um, corn. I got my drink, y'all. I just realized they was playing music in here, so I had to turn the camera off because my baby's all the girls are like, <laughs> she ain't true. <laughs> yeah, she cool. These one of them drinks that gonna stick up on you. I don't really like it. Hello? <laughs> I have to switch my drink. That drink was too sweet for me, so I got a margarita. I can't go wrong with a margarita. They put a little too much ice in it for me. And drinking, that's right. Fuck the food, just give me the drinks. <laughs> Always saying, send me the videos. Send me that video. Today. Send me the videos so y'all say, send me the videos from today. When you want to send it to me, when I die. Right, like, damn. <laughs> Forever, do everything. Said with them neighbors came to your house. What could you do? You know what? Once, once do? the bitch said you walking through hard across your floors, I said, bitch, this her apartment. Exactly. How she gonna walk? How you want to tell I, her how to walk on her apartment? I get mad but right you do got some heavy ass feet though. Said, what can you do to help for you to help? Hey y'all, welcome to the vlog. It's Monday. My friend leaving me today, y'all. <laughs> I'm be so sad and lonely. <laughs> <laughs> I'm mad I'm leaving. Don't worry, y'all. I'll be back soon. We didn't even get to do our um question Q and A or whatever the shit was I wanted to do. Cause we were so busy being turned up having fun. <laughs> no, for real. We gonna do it when I come in. I'll be back, y'all. I'm about to take this pill. I was later and I'm back. I took my lashes off. I always have lashes on, but I was cleaning them earlier and the hair came out of one, so I'm like, I'm gonna just get put a new pair on, but I ain't feel like putting them on today. I ain't really going nowhere. I dropped my friend off at the airport. Now I'm lonely in my house. My not going in my room. I'm gonna finish watch this movie I was watching on Amazon on Prom. Yeah, on Prom. It's good. Um, I got a whole bunch of apps that I pay for on Prom. So. When I was driving on the highway, like, I really get anxiety a lot driving, especially on the highway and at nighttime because I really can't see that good. Well, I can see good. Let me not say that. Hold on. I'm making spaghetti for my kids for dinner. But, um, so I was driving and this truck was so close to me. It's like this was the back of my car. This is the, the back of my car and this was him like so close and i'm just and he got bright lights on real bright like i hate cars that have bright lights on and get behind you and then they like they lights is blinding you you can't even really see so i'm like oh my god can he please just go around me so i start slowing down because i'm hoping he'll get the hint and go around me because everybody out here for speeds they fly like nobody really does a speed limit on the highway out here like speed limit is 65 and they doing probably 100 plus most drivers i don't drive 100 i might 80 the most and that's it so um he kept like blinking his lights, blinking his lights on me, his bright lights. One minute he'll put them on, next minute he take them off, he put them back on again. I had to turn that water off. Next minute he he was just basically having the lights on and off, flashing, flashing. And I'm like, what is he doing? Like, why he just don't go around? If I'm, it was a car in front of me, of course, it's other cars in front of you. So I'm just like, this drop, this guy just needs to go around. Like, instead of keep blinding me with your lights. So then... 
I, he getting closer and closer to me. So I'm like, so, do, are you going to hit me? Like, what are you trying to do? Because I, the more I slowed down, the closer he was to my car. And a car had came on the highway and jumped in front of me. Well, they had they sitting on, so I let them go. So I started breaking, and he's still on me, on my back, on the back of my car. And I'm just like, oh, my God, this man just needs to go around. It literally, He literally was behind me. My son started noticing that he kept flashing his blinking his lights on and off my son was like why are he blinking the lights like that at at um the car i'm like i don't know what this man is trying to do but he just needs to go around so now my anxiety is going up even more i'm getting more i'm getting nervous because i'm like oh my god can he please just go around i didn't want to switch lanes because i was in my right lane so he wouldn't go around well he finally went around but it, it felt like it lasted so long with him just being on the back of my car like i'm I just be happy. I don't be getting into no accidents. And I pray, thank God, every time I get home because these jobs, every day it's an accident out here. They drive crazy. Like, I got one. Um, it was a three car pile up today when my friend was here two days ago. We saw two cars went head on. They crashed into each other, but the street is a one way street. So we was like, how the hell did they crash facing each other? And it's a one-way street. Everybody's going down this way. So how did they do that? I don't even know. But that was it. I just, I'm like, yeah, this is exactly why I don't like driving at nighttime. Because if it was the daytime, I felt like I would have been able to see it a little bit better. I got my bright lights on. But still, when you drive at nighttime, everybody who got bright lights, they flashing. And you can't even really see that good. When I first started driving in New York, I used to like complain about people lights blinding me when I used to drive a night time on the I'm using this for my spaghetti. Well, I'm just I got the water boiling. I'm trying to add the sauce and the meat and everything. Got my spaghetti. And we got this garlic bread. That garlic bread is really good. Got my spaghetti sauce in the fridge. I had a great weekend with my friend. I'm so glad she came out here. Like, we really, really had a good time. And it was much needed fun. I'm chatting and not paying attention to the skillet was getting hotter. I don't really like adding oil to ground meat because it's already really greasy. But I just want to brown my um, peppers and onions, saute them a little bit. I don't know what I'm doing this week. I don't really have no plans, y'all. chicken I have to get everything out the fridge I wanted to do like a sit down Q&A with my friend we was going to ask each other questions but we was trying to play the game but that didn't work because that game was for more people not just two I had it for a while but I'll probably bring it around my other friends when I go to New York I don't want these to go bad. I feel like these go bad fast. My friend had bought these to cook with. I was watching. I don't know if y'all watch um, Love and Hip Hop Reunion. It's on in Safari. Um, Erica Minna caught Safari cheating. It was posted. This probably happened a while ago. But you know, by the time the show aired, it it comes out on TV. So I'm just like, Safari's a clown. Like, I used to like him and think he was good for her, but I'm like, oh, he's a whole clown. He always doing something. I'm just like, he didn't get it together yet. Like, it's crazy. They got two kids and everything. And Erica always crying over him. And I'm just like, he got to get it together. He's too old for that. Well, I mean, I guess age don't even matter because these guys don't even be having this together. And they be 40 plus and they still don't have it together. They still out here cheating. They want to sleep with everything moving. They got a whole family at home. And they still, they don't care. 
and he's still chasing behind other females instead of being faithful and being a good man to today, today, today woman and everything. I don't know how he is as a father, but um, some guys feel like because they're a good father and, and stuff, they don't, um, it don't matter if they cheat or whatever. They go, oh, I'm a good father. I do what I gotta do. And you're not faithful. And you out here sleeping with everything moving and you could bring me anything. Why well, you can't be trusting people. I was telling my friend, like, I don't know, people be going on guys from these dating apps and I'll be iffy because I said nowadays you think you're going out to have a good time with somebody from one of these dating apps that you meet and they end up plotting and trying to kill you, which is crazy. I hate when you put a water on the boil and then you start seeing little stuff in it. Noodle, watch this thing for the microwave. Okay. I was outside the whole weekend. We was outside. I'm about to catch up on some of my YouTubers. I ain't, I'm about to watch some YouTube videos. my hand all in the camera I gotta write down everything that I want to make this week for dinner
noodle. It looked like a lot, but it ain't that much. Put the blender over here. You might as well watch everything you put in that sink. Uh, Instead of later. Yeah, I don't know. I'm thinking put these here. And don't just really think. Put the strainer in the sink so I can um, dump the spaghetti when it's time.
your W-2 and file Fed and state for free. Simple tax return. She never did what she needed to do, but she got her rocks off by the little young, young, the little young. I'm too sexy for this train. Too sexy for your game. Too sexy for this train. Yeah, yeah. I'm too sexy for the trap. Too sexy for that trap. Too sexy for that trap. Actually, I'm um, getting ready to go to the gym. You know, your girl has been working out. I'm trying to see. Make sure I'm getting all my stuff out the room. I'm watching my boy Dame. Oh, you can't see. <laughs> but that's what I'm watching. I need to make me some water. Do y'all use, do y'all bring bottles of water to the gym? Or do y'all make your own water? my own water. I used to bring bottles to the gym and then I was kind of wasting them. I'd have like a little bit left in them and then I would leave them like in my car and stuff like that. No. We ain't doing that no more. We're not wasting our money, so. Let me set y'all up. Let me set y'all up. Can you see me? I got my hoodie on. Because... Alright y'all, so I finished making spaghetti. I put cheese parmesan on it, so that's what I added on the top. Oh, the kids won't eat these. Eat this. I'm still trying to stick to my little diet. I'm going to um, just eat a little ground beef and sauce. I don't really. I still ain't finished. I bought Chipotle early, me and my friend, and I ain't finished my food yet. But I'm going to. Um, so I don't really buy takeout because I don't ever eat my whole meal. Still got my order sitting in the room. I'm going to put it up. I ain't even finished my food yesterday. I should have got the shrimps my friend got. Those shrimps was good. I don't know when I'm going back out again, but I'ma um see if I get some strengths from that seafood place, cause I, my fish was okay. But. All right, y'all. I'll probably end this vlog here. I'm not too sure, but um, if you enjoy this vlog, like, give it a thumbs up, comment, subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet, and enjoy the videos i post and what are you waiting for if you haven't became a bella yet all my bella gangs we doing this for this shit <laughs> all right y'all later